Good morning, everybody. This is Mrs. Avery here, principal of Joseph Case Junior High School with Backyard Enrichment video number 22. Here once again in my backyard in Swansea. Um, I had to get out really early this morning. I, I got up, I turned on channel 12, and uh, meteorologist Pete Mangione told me that uh, it's going to rain pretty soon. And it was something I wanted to do today, which required me to be outside. So I quickly packed the stuff up and headed out here to do backyard enrichment number 22. Start today's backyard enrichment video, as we do all of our backyard enrichment videos, with a bit of appreciation. Uh, today I was thinking about our school resource officer and my friend Shane Mello, usually works with us on a day-to-day -day basis in the schools, but during this time of school closure, he's out working around town, keeping us all safe on the front lines. So every day, uh, we appreciate you at school, Officer Mello, and especially during these tough times of school closure out there, keeping us safe and working for the town. We appreciate you. Thank you. Uh, for all that you do. So yesterday was a really nice day. Uh, the sun was shining, there was lots of things you could do. So we got our work done and when the work was done we went out in the yard. Jake and I went for a bike ride. We had a wiffle ball game. We just sat around on a patio and talked for a little while, um, which was really nice. After dinner there was a card game. It was Hearts and Mrs. Silvera, who is really good at that game, uh, was victorious in the game of hearts. So for our backyard enrichment video today I was I was walking around out here yesterday and I saw something I thought would be really interesting for a backyard enrichment video. On all of these trees behind me there are buds on the end. Some bigger than others all very interesting and I thought to myself what better thing to do in springtime than to look at a bud. And a bud is actually a sign of hope it's, it's waiting for the right time to open up and flourish, and I thought that that was a great sign of hope. So today, let's take a quick walk around here and look at some buds that are around my yard in springtime. A bud is a tree's way of getting a leaf or flower through the winter. When it's too cold and water is locked up in ice, plants can't grow. But even in a cold winter climate, woody plants can get a head start on next year by forming buds while it's still warm and then pausing their growth until spring. The buds are usually protected by modified leaves called bud scales that overlap to cover them and seal them against the weather. Some buds, such as those of magnolia trees, are covered with an insulating fuzz. Most are leaf buds. Inside, immature leaves are tightly packed, ready to unfold when the weather gets warm enough and the sap starts running. Some species buds already hold all the leaves the tree will grow the next season. Others hold the first batch with more leaves developing after the bud opens. Buds are the promise not just of leaves but of branches. Trees grow two ways. They add width as cells divide under the bark and they add length when cells divide at the tips of twigs. Every branch on every tree, even the massive branches of an oak, grew from the bud at the tip of a slender twig. If a tree or shrub is mature enough and belongs to a species that blooms in spring, some of its adornments may be flower buds rather than leaf buds, as is the case here. If you look closer, you can tell them apart. Flower buds are usually bigger. A flower bud contains an entire dogwood or forsythia bundled up to keep it safe, waiting for the right time to open. Although buds don't grow much when it's cold, they do gradually change. If you check from time to time, you'll see them getting larger toward bud burst. If you get out in the yard today, take a look around at your house. There are many, many different kinds of buds around. If you take a look at them or take a picture and bring it in, you can usually find resources on the internet will help you identify exactly what bud that is, or what tree it belongs to. Well, I completed the video before the rain. That is our backyard enrichment video for today. Hope that everybody enjoyed it. Hope that everybody learned a little something. Uh, watching the weather, seems that there will be some time this afternoon when it is actually not raining. So there will be a little bit of time, I think, that you can get outside your yard. There's all kinds of buds. If you look around on the trees, shrubs, and things around your yard, you'll see tons of different buds, all different varieties, all different shapes. Really a wonder of nature. Have a great day, everybody. I'll be back with you tomorrow. 
Remember, we're all in this together, as we always say, as I hear a cardinal in the background, we are all cardinals. Thanks, have a great day.